it's Gucci Westman. Hi guys, I'm gonna do a makeup tutorial. What should we do? I'm super inspired by my new Le Rouge Lip Suede, four shades. This is obviously the shade I'm gonna go for. So whatever comes to mind, it's gonna be very fresh. It's gonna be minimal on the face and it's gonna be all about this red. I'm gonna play with Julia here, Julia Murray, who's so gorgeous. Have you seen she has two different colored eyes? I mean, how beautiful is that? I'm gonna put Lit Up under her foundation and I'm gonna go fast. A little on the nose, we're gonna make Julia's skin even more beautiful than it is. I really like the idea of super emphasized skin, like really pumping up the radiance of the skin. Okay, we're gonna go fast and we're gonna make this gorgeous. I'm gonna put some face trays, give you a little contour. I like to do these, take these steps of putting you know, highlight, contour before the foundation because I feel like it looks more lived in and more blended. And I'm blending the contour with my foundation brush. And then afterward, you can kind of see if you need more or not. But Julia also has gorgeous skin, so she's gonna need minimal foundation. So I am mixing Atelier N and Atelier 1. So I'm gonna use N, which is super neutral, just under Julia's eyes. I just wanna even out her skin tone and then I'll add back any color that I want afterwards. So pretty. That's foundation, done. So now I might, you know, I might just add a little bit more highlight to the Cupid's bow, a little bit more to the cheek. And then I kind of want to actually use our super loaded tinted highlight in Pot de Soleil. Okay, so I'm going over Julia's eyes also with the super loaded tinted highlight. So pretty. So then I just might pop in a little bit of a rosy cheek, just a tiny subtle cheek. And I'm going to actually combine a bit of doo-doo and pop it, just because I want to have a subtle, subtle flush. Sometimes I even go a little bit on the bridge of the nose with a brush, just a tiny, tiny bit. Not to get like a, you know, boozy nose, but just a tiny bit. Okay, now I've pretty much finished with the skin, and now I'm going to go in with a future release that's super exciting for the eyes. And again, super translucent. I love the transparency when you have everywhere, you know, it feels like it's breathable and it's still sexy. And now, clean mascara. I love you. So this is 96% natural. Okay, guys, here we go. Look, oh, my lip suede. Do you like the name? My husband was like, lip suede, what? And I was like, yes, that sounds dreamy to me. Close for a sec and look at your prettiest. Oh, I mean, you guys, this is sick. Look how pretty this color is. Your dick. See, and then everything else kind of is gonna fade and it's gonna look like you have a little bit of makeup on, but it's not overwhelming and you don't look like, you know, a show pony for makeup, you look more like just a total babe. So there's a, a really significant blend of cherry and marula oils in the formula. So it's super hydrating and collagen boosting. And it's like at efficacy levels, as you guys may or may not know, I always do the efficacy level as opposed to the marketing level. And then I always like to, after you know, doing like a real lip, to clean it up a little bit with a brush and some foundation afterward. And you never know, you might have two parties, three parties in one night, and you might have, you might feel like switching it up. So we're just gonna pop in a bit of gloss for the, you know, Julia's next party. Why not? 
So which one do we prefer, the second party or the first party? <laughs> Let me know in the comments what you guys think. <laughs>